In the quiet countryside of Wayne County, Iowa, a remarkable archaeological find is currently being uncovered from the state's distant past. Today, on Documentify TV, we are researching this latest discovery in the small creek bed. Let's see what has been discovered. Along the gently flowing creeks and rolling hills, researchers have unearthed the remarkably well-preserved skull of a 13,600-year-old mastodon, a monumental discovery that is rewriting the history of human megafauna interactions in the region. The story began in the fall of 2022, when a local resident stumbled upon a peculiar bone protruding from the bank of a small creek. Recognizing the potential significance of the find, the resident alerted the experts at the University of Iowa's Office of the State Archaeologist, OSA, who quickly sprang into action. Upon closer inspection, the OSA team confirmed that the bone belonged to a mastodon, a massive elephant-like creature that roamed North America during the Pleistocene era, going extinct around 10,500 years ago. Intrigued by the discovery, the archaeologists returned to the site the following year, where they made an even more remarkable find, a large tusk emerging from the earth, suggesting that a complete mastodon skull lay buried beneath the surface. With funding secured from the Wayne County Foundation and the Prairie Trails Museum of Corridon, the OSA team embarked on a meticulous 12-day excavation in August 2024 painstakingly uncovering the ancient skull and several other mastodon bones the researchers were able to determine through radiocarbon dating that this incredible specimen dated back a staggering 13,600 years a time when the first human inhabitants were just beginning to establish a presence in the region this is an absolutely remarkable find explained john dorshuk director and state archaeologist at the osa Mastodon remains are relatively rare in Iowa, and this is the first time a well-preserved skull has been scientifically excavated in the state. The potential to uncover evidence of human-mastodon interactions is truly thrilling. Indeed, the discovery of this ancient mastodon skull has ignited the scientific community's imagination, as researchers hope to find clues about the ways in which these early Iowans may have coexisted with the megafauna that once roamed the land. Dorshuk and his team are particularly keen to find evidence of butchering or hunting, such as cut marks on the bones or the presence of ancient stone tools when examination of the artifact is carried out. But this is not the only remarkable artifact to be unearthed in Iowa's rich archaeological landscape. The state is home to some of the oldest human remains discovered in North America. The oldest artifacts found in Iowa are Clovis points, large lanceolate points used by Paleo-Indian hunters and gatherers. These points date back approximately 13,500 to 10,500 years ago. They were likely used to hunt large Pleistocene megafauna, such as mammoths, mastodons and giant bison. While there are many Clovis sites scattered across Iowa, the most well-known is the Rummel's Mask Cache site in Cedar County. This site has yielded numerous Clovis points, as well as other artifacts from the Paleo-Indian period. As the OSA team continues to analyze and conserve the Mastodon skull and other bones, the possibilities for what this remarkable discovery might reveal about the intricate relationship between these ancient humans and the giant creatures that once roamed the Iowan countryside are truly endless. What other secrets might this land hold waiting to be uncovered? Share your thoughts and insights in the comments below and join us again next time for more documentaries right here on Documentify TV.